Hey everybody, in this video, I want to show you guys how to download the new shop manager, how you get it, and um, how it works. So, when you, after you make your purchase or your subscription, you go in, and this is a test file that I downloaded. Um, so, you'll get an email that will say, thanks for shopping with us, and whatnot, and it has the product that you ordered and your download file. Only thing you have to do here is click on the download and download it. Once you download it, it's going to download as a zip file. Move, uh, remove it out of the zip folder, so you're going to extract it to wherever you want to, wherever you want to keep that folder. But inside of that folder, there are several different. Um, several different um oh god i'm so sorry i'm so tired there are several different folders inside of that folder um make sure that you leave all of this intact the way it is this is the fault the file that you need the one that says application once you've got that application file then you can run it um and then you can create a shortcut on your desktop. And I'm just going to go in and kind of show the file because there are a few people who have already downloaded. Um, I had some issues with the site this week. And then I had to put software back up. So it's just been really, really rough. This is how it opens up. Once it opens up, um, on first run, I've already ran this, but on first run, there's a user agreement. You just click on the user agreement and then your software will run. It's taking a little bit longer to open because I do have the recorder on. Once it opens up, this is how it opens up. So when it opens up, you've got your little t-shirt calculator here and then you've got the Excel environment in the background and I like to go ahead and just enlarge that um, if you move that on over this is actually the quote form here and just kind of take you through all of this so when you want if you've got your create job proof you can go in create your job proof that's your job proof form this is kind of in the way but you can close it down uh, you can view any job orders that you currently have and you'll know when those job orders are due and you can track them you can go in add a customer to your database you can view things such as uh, sales reports looks like that sales report uh, is locked. I'm going to have to unlock that one. You've got new products. So this is this is new and this is really cool because now you can enter in a style number brand description, set your wholesale and your markup costs and just enter the product there. And you've got expense report. Um, add expenses I'm not going to go through all of this you can look up your customers look up quotes and all of that and of course the big red button here is going to be where you would do your um, your invoice let's go here to settings under settings you've got apparel lookup or you can look up and do look up the apparel by style numbers and all of that each all of these little drop downs do stuff add shirt colors um, in this newest version you are able to give discounts based on quantity when do anything with up charges uh, set up your screen printing costs and I'm not going to show how I set up my screen printing costs in the video I guess I will I'll click it and kind of cover it over a little bit. But this is screen printing costs. You've got shop a shop overhead form, your heat transfer stuff. 
other printing types, which is this area is great for embroidery, signs, any other type of printing that you do. And then your art fees, delivery times, and company information. So if you had just opened up the file, the first thing you want to do, it's going to open up here. You need to go in and set it up. Go here, add in your company information, and then edit any of these buttons that you need to edit in. For example, if you're here on apparel discount, not apparel discounts, let's see. Um, show you one that you can go in on apparel colors and you want to edit these colors here you just click here and then you can go over here and you can do a bulk edit so everything here will show here and it'll automatically update so you can go here you could type in Two, for example, if my upcharge is two dollars, and I could drag that down, kind of close that down out of the way. I could drag this down, and that would change all of that. Okay, but I don't want to do that. Same thing here. Um, so just go in. Follow each one of these prompts. Set it up the first time. Once you're done, you don't have to do that again. If you need any help, there are video tutorials. And this is the customer support button. Um, you've also got shipping and distributors, which I'm still working on that part. Um, and this big button here is for a future update. So that's basically everything i'm gonna get me some rest and you guys um this will be up tonight or first thing in the morning i'll go ahead and put it back up but i want to do some testing on it before i run it anyways thanks for watching make sure you hit the like subscribe go to latana.com and get you some stuff for your shop okay and uh stay tuned for more videos Thanks for watching.